Keep to the side here. I'm gonna have to walk on the grass. Yeah, well, at least you can walk down it safely. Not any. Station Cottage
I've got the sun on me so I'm just struggling a little bit to uh, get a proper shot so if anybody is into old railways and stuff like myself then we came across this weeks ago but it's absolutely beautiful it really is and especially with the LN and ER Cleethorpes and obviously I can't get in to film the boards up close it's a really big chain I like the light as well that light is really nice yeah it's a lovely light that for an old one that's why the camera's gone a bit daft camera's just gone a bit daft I do apologise but yeah, a few weeks ago when we came across this place. So if anybody does remember this, it's definitely well worth coming to take some photographs. I'm totally honest. I like the old uh, barra as well, what's there. Like I said, my camera just keeps going a bit daft. Because I just knocked it again this morning. Didn't mean to. But yeah, absolutely lovely. And you can see the, um, the levers inside as well. Yeah, beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. Now, you can't... Well, I, I'm not going to anyway. But you cannot go anywhere through the gate, unfortunately. It's a really big shame as well. It is. It's a really big shame. Big shame I couldn't go through the gate and take a closer look at them boards, but unfortunately, you can't. It's a shame. But yeah, weeks ago, uh, we passed this place and we said we'd pop back out and take a bit of a look. But it is really nice to see. It really is even when we drove past it anyway so that's that so I'm going to take it this would have gone all the way to Cleethorpes from the LNER sign over there in the background yeah stunning absolutely stunning that right so where are we today well that's just give the game away it's called leg ball so we're gonna just go and take a bit of a walk somewhere and there's some old gates further down as well so we'll just take a, a walk down. Yeah, I know it's a bit of mud. Right, so we're gonna walk down. We'll leave the car in this car park. I know you can soon get it off, can't you? Go to the gates and then we'll just see what's down there. We'll just take a look, see what's down there anyway. Right, on that board, um, it's, it says LNER and it says Cleethorpes. So, trains must have gone from here straight to Cleethorpes. Hey? Right, the message has just come through from three. Right, might be trainers now. Yeah, it's a really big shame as uh, as I couldn't have got any closer. It's a really big shame. Never mind, it's fine.
Right, so what we'll do, we're going to know these gates and we'll jump in the car and we'll go into the village. Best in how we've come for that anyway. Right, what we'll do, we'll go and jump in the car and we'll park up in the village somewhere and have a, a walk about, eh? Right? Well, well you, we can either have a walk in the park where we parked or we can go and have a walk around that village. It's up to you. Let's see what I see, isn't it? What, in the park? Yeah. Well, come on then, we'll walk around the park then. If there's not much there, we'll go into Legbourne itself. It's it is, isn't it? Another well, message just just come through. I'm not going to read it until we are done. Some of that and this your call or something. This place where we are at this uh, Legbourne picnic site. Just want to point out it has got toilets, which are open, which is brilliant as well. So we don't know what's here. I'm just going to go and have a look, and if there's not much, we're going to drive into Legbourne itself. When it does say it's a picnic place here. Um, and it looks like you can go for a walk about in some woods and stuff as well. So it's worth just having a look. And then you've got a little picnic tables or a picnic table, which is just here. <coughs> hey? Yeah, they are, aren't they? That's the, the good thing about this place though, isn't it? At least it has got toilets and stuff, so that's that's even better, isn't it? Well, that's the reason why we come, for that old uh, railway um, bits and pieces. Now I've got the sun, it's really strong as well. Now, I don't know where this takes us. We do not know. <laughs> oh well, stuck us around the circle for a start. No, oh, it don't matter. Yeah. Yep. Yeah, it's quiet. Seems a nice place to, to come and walk. Well. As I said earlier, I mean, we noticed that weeks ago, didn't we? When we drove up to Mablethorpe. Uh, oh, let's go this way then. 
and I said like we'd have a drive back out to go and take a look and obviously we have done that's why we're here today now I don't know where this takes us new not new follow it round There's a fence there, there's like a little bit of a walkway, but that's about it. There's that way onto a field, so that's what you're doing. Oh, you're slipping. Oh. Hey? Why a fence? Yeah, right, so that's as far as it takes you then. Right, come on then, we'll go into the village then. We'll go back and get the car out. Uh, which way did we come? Oh, we'll go back this way. Yeah, but it does say it's a picnic area. But yeah, it was so nice to to see that uh, old signal gantry and the the little box with all the levers and that in at least it's still there still original that's good and then again wet feet <laughs> should have gone around the other way no matter should have gone back the way we come from that it is a nice little picnic area well I mean you've only got one little seat in place but I don't know what yeah you've only got that all right bring you back No, we'll just take a walk about and just see in it. Mm. This is a short term calling bay. Oh yeah. Cottages. Okay. <laughs> I like that. That is really Hessel House. <laughs> Make a difference. No difference have them on your walls. Yeah, if that wind, it would, wouldn't it? It'd be a bit more warm if that wind had just dropped. Church walk. What's that all about then? I'll take a look, I think. Nice. So you've got a 
public footpath down there as well. It takes you into some bungalows. That says church walk, so what do you want to do? You want to I'll go up here first and then we'll have a walk up and see what, what is up there and what isn't. What again? What yours or mine? Yeah. Or mine. <laughs> Typical. Lovely. Oh. That light boat. Something about a light boat over there. You can zoom into that. Okay. Alright, wait a minute. Alright. coming. It is a bit of a bad place to cross, but never mind. Yeah, I can't believe that, uh, oh wow, oh, so this is the old post office. Right, hang on then. Let's, uh, as well for an old post office. Alright, let's see what this is up here then. Oh, we'll get some footage of this. Tell you what though, this stands out, doesn't it? Hey? Okay. Eh? Yeah I know. I spotted it. Yeah let's give us a minute. Oh it has got some writing on it. Gorgeous. What an old bell. That is absolutely beautiful. Now it's 
hang on, I'm going to see if I can try and zoom in a little bit better. Honestly, that is apt. I f to be honest, I, I reckon, I reckon somebody lives in it. But it's stunning. On the way back, I'll just go around that corner and see if I can get a bit closer up to that. If I can, would be nice. Hey, <laughs> that trick. Why? There's a service. There's a service. Yeah. Right, well, we'll just take a walk around the church then. And show the yeah, entrance. Yeah, All right. Yeah, well, it is Sunday. I'm still out worth having a bit of a nosy, I'm totally honest. A little bit of a nosy round. Keely, wanna go and try and back to that where that bell is and try and get some closer footage. What's around there anyway? Let's have a quick log. It's just a road. Eh? It's just a road. Yeah, hang on, I've just spotted something. Mm -hmm. Give us a minute. Alright, so you come through there then. Oh, so it's like a a lane. Alright. Is that what it is? I'll tell you what though, that's old. A bit of an old building. Well, old house, cottage, should I say. Like the uh, post box. Yeah, we'll come back another time then, that's not a problem. Yeah, I just want to see if I can get a bit closer to where that bell is. What's that I've just noticed? Somewhere up there on the church, if I can. Might not be able to, but I'll try. Mm. Yeah, I thought I'd try and get some more of that really old bell because it's uh, it's different. <laughs> but I am going to say that could have been the old chapel. That's what I think it was. No, I'm just. Yeah, well, it's Sunday, isn't it? So. Yeah, I'm gonna say if if this wasn't no chapel, well that's Rose Cottage. 
and that's nice as well and then it could have been an old Methodist church or something it's worth having a look anyway why not we're here now so Oh well, they do make these vehicles so quiet. They really do. I can barely hear them. I'm going to spin the camera back round to this. Alright, and then there's something else down there. Looks like some type of old place as well. But that, honestly, that is stunning. I do like that bell up there. I really do. Really nice. Shame it didn't have a date. These are somewhat above the door. But the problem is, I can't get close enough to read the stuff on it big shame like you know that just above the door Keely there's there's um, some writing but I can't get close enough to it because obviously somebody's working in there as well so that's what I mean in it I don't want to be it's like there's some up there as well might, you might, you might be able to make that out up there. More, some mortal, summit villa. It's right at the top. I can't read it. It looks like eighteen thirteen. If it's not 18, it's 1913, but it's one of them. It could be 1813, could be. Alright, we'll carry on walking up here then. Yeah, we'll come back for that. If anybody's never been here, I just want to point it out, it's on your way to Mablethorpe. Yeah, you got some proper little uh, S-Bends here, so... Got some nice properties though as well. Looks like a nice place. So I've never been before, like, but it does. Got a village all here somewhere. Stop to your right. Archery. Wednesdays 6 till 8. Alright, oh, let's go around here then. Take a look at this as well. Oh, that is stunning. That is absolutely beautiful, that is. Look at that. Wow. Very nice. Oh, there's a line up there. Didn't see that line straight between. Where the you might be able to make that line out, hopefully. Yeah, that is nice. I like the points as well. Church house. Oh, hang on, there's a date. 1892. Can just make this one out. Just there, if anybody can read that, but it says 1892. Very nice. Right, we'll walk down here and we'll have to take a walk down to where the village hall is as well. Look at that, honestly, look at that. How stunning, I like the doors as well, because they're so original. That is 
beautiful, honestly. What a place. Yeah, what a place. Right, we'll go down here then to the village hall, take a look. Cherry Lodge. As the wind has picked up actually compared to what it was. Oh, there's a plaque up here of some kind. Let's see if I can. There's some writing as well. See if I can zoom into that. Can't make out the. Can't make out what it says on that plaque. It's a really big shame. Morning. Morning. Anybody know how old that place is? What? Fire Earth? I don't know. It says on the front. Yeah, I didn't want to be. I, when I zoomed into the actual plaque, I didn't get a clear enough shot of it. 1902. 1982. 02. 02, 02. sorry. Yeah, yeah I, didn't want to, I didn't want to go up your grass and. Unless you just let me just go up the grass and Wouldn't zoom further in. It? Sorry? Appreciate that, thank you. Yeah, so the date is 1902. It's very kind of the gentleman for allowing me to come up his grass as well so I can get closer to it. But yeah, that's really nice, that. Yeah, lovely. Yeah, appreciate that, thank you. And just above his window as well, there's, a, there's like a, another carving of some kind well yeah nice well that was beautiful victoria cottages 1902 wow appreciate that young man thank you it's very kind of you thank you very much right a little bit of information about the signal box um at legbourne station um it's it's not from Legbourne, uh, the actual signal box is from Sutton. So we've got another one here, which is uh, Albert Cottage, or Cottages. Now, up there, yeah, same as that gentleman's, I'm, but obviously there's nobody here, so I'm not gonna go walking up the grass but there is a date and I could think it could be round about the same era as what's on that gentleman's and then next to that it still says uh, number two Albert Cottages as well so we're gonna take a walk up here now we've just been told about something else um, of interest within this village so the gentleman who I've just been talking to who was just giving me the information on the signal box has just told us about something with a little bit more interest as well so when we're done here we're going to go and find what the gentleman has told us about <clears throat> now you've got your community centre down here which the gentleman's just said um, it's the old reading room and apparently they moved the old reading room from from further in the village down to where I'm taking you <coughs> and then obviously you've got your cricket pavilion just over in the background as well What? Right. 
and they've got a deep up here which is brilliant as well right we'll get off and we'll try and find that now what that gentleman's uh, told us about yeah and then obviously i've asked that gentleman well he overheard the conversation and uh, but yeah so the information on legbourne station the signal box is from sutton and it was brought from sutton to where it's situated now so i'll bring you back when we get further down onto the main road right uh more information on uh, what you're looking at um and the gentleman i was talking to said this used to be the old school so at least now we know what it was now that is really nice <coughs> that is beautiful wow Look at that. Is this part of the uh, water mill? Right. Yeah, I'll I'll get all this on the way back. I'm just more interested in the water mill at the moment to to see what I can right well yep it comes from there all the way down right well right well what we'll do we'll just walk up then and uh this is the water mill is it here oh wow It's a really big shame as well. Cut that. I'll try to zoom into that water wheel, um, and it's right at the side of the. Wow. Cut that. Now that is beautiful. Wow. Proper working water wheel. Wow. Appreciate that, thank you. Thank you ever so much. Right, I will pro I'll probably how far up is that then? Right, and then turn right. Yeah. Right, thank you. Thank you ever so much. Tell you what, it's a shame it won't go in round. That is a really, really big shame that wasn't going round that. Uh, we have been told, obviously, this is all private, so I can't go walking down. Really, really big shame as well. Would have been nice just to get a bit more closer up. But how stunning that looks full stop. It is, isn't it? Let's look at it though. Yeah, lovely. Absolutely lovely. The barn by the stream. Different, unusual, but yeah, that <laughs> that is absolutely. Cut that. Yeah, I'm glad we've come now. Very nice. Uh, so. We've just been told if we walk further up here, about five minutes or something, I don't know what that board says, public 
Oh, trespassers. Yeah, you can understand having a big sign like that. Why not? At the end of the day, innit? Yeah, so as I was going to say, <laughs> just further up here apparently, um, there's a, a stream. Now the stream apparently goes round and it's the actual uh, stream what runs or did run the water mill. And apparently there's a, a ford as well. So we're going to take a little bit of a walk up. Uh, she said something about there's a pub, pub or something, uh, just up here. Apparently, it runs down near the pub now. Well, we're parked. I'm going to point out if we'd have known, we'd have drove all the way up here. Oh wow, chuffy you now. Yeah, I know. I, I'm not going all the way in, but wow. This. Oh, I can even hear the water at the back. It's a shame I just couldn't walk through and take a... Yeah, uh, yeah, that's what we're going to do. We're going to go up and take a walk around. Right, I'll bring you back when we get further up. Yeah, if anybody's in, interested in a bit of a nice break and the light fishing, I'd probably say give this a ring. Kingfisher cabin, otter pods, badgers. But well, yeah, seriously, I uh, I would say it's worth a try. Well, tell you what, there is some very old stuff here. Definitely, some very old stuff. Right, so we're just about to where we, hey? Hey? Oh. There's a, no, there's a path. Just try and go around the puddles if you can. Wow. So this is the Ford. Um, the lady was talking about so this is what used to run the water wheel or the water mill and look at this how beautiful this is wow now this was worth coming to Legbourne even if we came for one thing and ended up finding something else There's a proper Ford, this one, isn't it? This is a lot different to that other Ford that we uh, went to. And I won't recommend anybody trying to drive through one of these. I have seen it done before in some different places, but I wouldn't recommend it. Not at all. <coughs> oh, nice, very nice. Hats off to Legborn. So if anybody's wanting to come and take a walk and come and see an old water mill and stuff. Right, I'll bring you back when uh, Keely's rolled a fag. <coughs> yeah, we're only going to walk so far and then we're going to head back. But we are going to come back to this location and we're going to walk most of this because it is well worth it mm. 
Yeah, well, like I said, we're going to walk so far because where we're part, I don't want to be getting blocked in. It's off the road. But of course, that's not the point. And then we was told about some statues on the way back, so I'm going to try and take a look at them as well. That as well, it's on the way back, so... But yeah, this is definitely where we're going to come back to. I'm going to do a complete full walk. about two foot deep further up here it's nice ah you do get it you do get it look at that for like a little summer house as well <laughs> brilliant yeah why not Oh wow, we'll just go as far as this then, and then we'll head back, because it all bends off here anyway, but it is uh, a lovely walk, even for just this short bit of a walk, still nice, oh it's got a little bridge here as well, oh Keely, I've got to go, I've got to go on the bridge. There's an actual water wheel working. Got to go and try to see this. Got to. It's all that long enough and you should be able to pause the video, read that, because that is very interesting. The watering stone. Yeah. Right, I'm going to try to zoom into this because I can't get no, I cannot get any closer to it. But the actual water wheel is actually going round. Look at that. Oh, isn't that stunning? Isn't that just stunning? Oh, Keely, come on. <laughs> nice, isn't it? Oh, a lot, anybody what's into this kind of stuff. Yeah, I've got to admit, I hope you enjoy. But look at that, how nice that is. No, the other one's apparently not working at the moment. How stunning that is. Wow. This was well worth coming here today, especially now anyway, especially now. Right, hang on a minute. So that's the pub. Look that. That, yeah. Not me bottoms. Thank you. <laughs> yeah, give me a minute. Just fascinated with it because it's so beautiful to see it.
stunning. Absolutely stunning. Right, so we're going to head back. I'll give you the, the name of the pub as well. Royal Oak Inn. Oh, wow. Got some uh, nice horse as well. Oh, look how, morning, look how beautiful he is. Oh, he's beautiful. I know I've seen him. <laughs> and uh, there's the bridge that I've just been stood on filming that water wheel. Yeah, and no. Ah, oh, let me just get out of the way then. Right, so uh, back now. yeah, so I'm gonna head back. Ah, uh, so yeah, it was a uh, well worth a visit. Oh, let me just reshow that board uh, with that information on. So for anybody what has missed it, I'll just quickly come back in. Right, so all you got to do is pause the video on that and uh, read that. Uh, yeah, so we're going to head back. Uh, I was told about some statues uh, on the way back, so we're going to take a quick look. I'm uh, going to follow this board. And I hope uh, anybody who likes water wheels, working ones, I hope you enjoy that. We will re-show the other one back off as we're going. Uh, so we don't want to bore people to death but yeah this uh, this is well worth coming <laughs> I'm gonna have to check out what jurisdiction leg bone comes under but I'll check that out later on and I'll put it on the description <laughs> what a nice place Yeah, very nice. I say so myself. I'm going to say this is probably going to be one of our best places that we've visited. Out of a lot of the villages. <laughs> um, and different places basically. But of course, every village that we do, we enjoy them. But because of what this this place has got to show, to film, to look at, to enjoy, I'm going to say it is one of the best ones we've done. Yeah, yeah, the church, unfortunately, uh, there was a service on, so I wasn't going to go and sit there filming a the service. Yeah, walk back, show these statues off on the way down. But uh, yeah, brilliant, like it. What a nice place to come. And especially now we've managed to get a working water wheel. Just a shame that this big one at the windmill okay. isn't, yeah, really big shame in it. So that, that would have looked absolutely lovely. But of course, you can't go walking down any closer to it which is a really big shame as well 
but that little have made up for it. So I'm happy enough. Yeah, but we didn't realise, did we? But yeah, beautiful. The video obviously is going on for over an hour, but with what's here, what's to see, you you've just gotta enjoy seriously. I mean that one just in the background there, that is well aged. No date on that unfortunately, shame, really big shame, but it's what it is. Right, I'll bring you back when we get to the uh, statues. Yeah, so there's that little bridge that uh, we spotted. Yeah, so we've, we've been given permission by, by uh, a lad called Will um, and Will said, yeah, it's mine. Yeah, 1847 Which one is it? This one here. Which? This one. This one here. Oh, this big white one? Yeah. So that's what, 1847? 1847. 1862. So you've got 1847. Oh yeah, it's up there, isn't it? 1862. Look at these old millstones. Yeah, so we're coming up to the water wheel now. Yeah, I'm going to take a look there as well. So here's the. Oh wow, look at this. Look at that. That is absolutely spot on. That is beautiful. Yeah, so just above there, 1862, brilliant, oh, wow look at that, that is lovely. And this is also being converted as well. From what Will from what Will has just told us. Look at this. It's huge. Yeah. Oh yeah, he's a he's a big one, isn't he? He's a beauty. Right, hang on a minute. Yeah, wonderful. Right, hang on. And I'm coming. Absolutely lovely. 
Beautiful. Yeah. Excellent. Right, we'll uh, head off now and we'll take a look at these wonderful statues. So, alright, oh, yeah, it's right at the top. I, did, I didn't see it at the top. Is it? Oh, yeah, it is right over there, isn't it? 1847, yeah. Pretty good. Excellent. Yeah, well worth it. So, uh, well, uh, it's a double thumbs up to you, lad, for allowing. Anybody want an hot tub? Right, we'll get off now and we'll take a look at some statues. And that's a lovely old place as well with a thatch roof on it. It's really nice. Oh my God. I cannot believe what I am seeing. Wow. That is a really nice owl. That is absolutely gorgeous, that is. Wow. Very nice. How stunning that is. Yeah. Very nice. And an old clock as well. Water Meadow Cottage. All right, okay. The Ulmont Place looks really nice and posh. All right, so we're going to get ready to wrap this video up now. Uh, what a nice place, Legbourne. Got to give you credit. Wonderful place, things to see and uh, it's really nice and quiet so it's a big thumbs up from me it's a big thumbs up from Keeley and uh, it is completely free to subscribe as well there is no charges uh, straight down I think yeah we did come straight down popular's lane Right, so what we're doing now, we're just more or less showing one or two bits and pieces now as we're walking back to where the car is. So we will be wrapping the video up just further down this bottom. Alright, spotted a cannon. So I might as well just zoom in, take a quick look. Wow. Very nice. Yeah just come across an old bell just there so, uh, just thought we'd just
just grab some quick footage right so we're gonna wrap the video up now uh, but I'm gonna do it just gonna zoom into the old school which is just there in the background so it's a big thumbs up from me it's a big thumbs up from Keely and we will see each and every one of you on the next one so right bye for now